it was tragic. It was really tragic what happened to him, the other lady, and Nikki. Sharon Nunez's husband, Armando, along with 38 year old Maria Martinez, died in the Royal Arms apartment fire back in March of 2009. 55 year old Nikki Kane is still in a coma due to her injuries. Investigators say the fire started because of a meth lab. But I never thought it was that big of a problem until it happens to you, and you see that totally innocent people can be affected or even killed. The defense said there was not enough evidence to link the fire to Robert's drug use. The jurors deliberated for nearly six hours. They acquitted him of three of his four charges. So that was kind of surprising to me because I kind of felt like it was going to be either all guilty or all not guilty. Only after the jurors delivered their verdict did they find out Roberts had several prior drug convictions, some related to meth. You could just see on their face that, I mean, it was just like horror, like, oh my God, what have we done? After that, the jury came back with a life in prison recommendation for his manufacturing charge. We hoped to get the murder charge, we didn't, but at the end of the day, we know he's going to prison for the rest of his life. Nunez says she is satisfied with the verdict as well, as long as it doesn't get changed in the appeals process. I'm concerned that they'll reduce the sentence or that he'll possibly be released and that he will be allowed to move next door to someone else and do the same thing again.